Welcome, welcome to the channel. Let's have a look at what the newspapers are saying on the 9th of June. The transfer speculation is starting to hot up now. We're getting all sorts of rumours, the Daily Star and other very uh, notable publications. <laughs> anyway, whatever. Only if you live in the UK do you know that the Daily Star is an interesting newspaper. Anyway, the Guardian is saying that Romelu Lukaku... Um, has been told by Chelsea that he can rejoin Inter Milan on loan, but um, he probably has a very large loan fee to pay, probably £20 million. I don't think Inter Milan are going to pay it. But uh, the Mail are reporting that Inter aren't confident because of the financial demands that Chelsea are putting on the deal. Pretty understandable. They paid almost £100 million quid for him. The Mirror are saying that Darwin Nunes is hesitant about joining Manchester United because they're not in the Champions League. The Daily Star say that Liverpool have pulled, have pulled in front of United in the race for Nunez. The Sun is saying that Nunes has informed Jurgen Klopp he would prefer a move to Liverpool. Marker is saying that Man United have made an initial offer of 60 million euros plus 20 million add-ons for 25-year-old Holland and Barcelona midfielder Frenkie de Jong. He's been in contact with Eric Ten Hag and it'd be an amazing signing for Man United. The Mail is saying that Gareth Bale could sign for Madrid-based Getafe because of his desire not to uproot his family following his exit from Real Madrid. Romano saying that Bale's agent, um, it's actually Jonathan Barnett. They've put it down here as Joshua Barnett. I know it's Jonathan Barnett has dismissed any link with the La Liga club. The Sun is saying that Richarlison, Richarlison has told Everton he wants to leave. The Mail are saying that Harry Kane is optimistic about Spurs' future under Antonio Conte. The Times are saying that Man City for Gabriel Jesus has been offered to Tottenham in a blow to Arsenal. The Sun are saying that Man City are trying to buy Calvin Phillips from Leeds. The Mail are saying that West Ham will listen to offers for Syed Ben Rama this summer. Talk Sport are saying that former Man United manager Louis van Gaal has warned Ajax defender Jurian Timber against the move to Old Trafford this summer. I, I looked at this yesterday and he was saying that if he doesn't play, then he's not going to go to the World Cup, which is understandable. The Times are saying that Tottenham have had their attempt to sign Marcus Rashford from Man United rejected. Goal are saying that Juve have cooled their interest in United forward Jesse Lingard after initially expressing an interest. He'll be on a free transfer at the end of the month. I'm sure he'll go to West Ham. Sky Sports say that PSV Eindhoven midfielder Ibrahim Sangara has set his heart on a move to the Premier League with Man United, Chelsea, Liverpool and Newcastle all monitoring the 24-year-old Ivorian. RMC Sports say that Man United and Chelsea are interested in Leicester City defender Wesley Fofana. The Mirror saying Inter Milan will keep hold of Alessandro Bastoni in a blow to Man United and Spurs. The Mail are saying that Southampton have made a move to sign Republic of Ireland goalkeeper Gavin Bazunu from Man City. And finally, the Sun are saying that Arsenal have been offered the chance to sign Swiss defender Manuel Akanji from Borussia Dortmund. I think he's on a free transfer as well. Might want big wages and a big signing on fee. So that's all your transfer spec. If, you'd, if you've heard any other transfer news, transfer spec, pop it in the comments below. And things are hotting up with the summer transfer window. Thanks for joining me and thanks for watching to the end. Cheers.